gaslighting, a manipulative tactic often used by narcissists. Welcome back to my channel where we delve into the darkest corners of human behavior. Today we'll be talking about gaslighting, a manipulative tactic often used by narcissists. Have you ever found yourself doubting your own reality, feeling confused and unsure of what's real or not? You might be a victim of gaslighting, a manipulative tactic often used by narcissists to control and deceive others. What is gaslighting? Gaslighting is a form of psychological manipulation where the abuser makes the victim doubt their own thoughts, feelings, and reality. It involves lying, denying, twisting the truth, and shifting blame. Narcissists use this tactic to maintain power and control over their victims. By making them question their own memory and sanity, they become more dependent on the narcissist for validation and approval. Gaslighting can take many forms, from subtle comments and actions to outright lies and denials. The narcissist may twist the truth, deny their wrongdoings, or blame the victim for their own mistakes and failures. How Narcissists Use Gaslighting Narcissists commonly use gaslighting to maintain control over their victims. They may deny saying or doing things even when the victim has proof, accuse the victim of being crazy, forgetful, or imagining things, minimize the victim's feelings and experiences, blame the victim for their own problems, isolate the victim from friends and family, testimonials of individuals sharing their experiences of gaslighting. Person 1. I always felt like I was going crazy, questioning everything I thought I knew. Person 2. It was like I couldn't trust my own instincts anymore. Trusting your instincts and seeking support from loved ones or professionals is important if you suspect you're being gaslit. Effects of gaslighting. Gaslighting can have severe consequences for victims, including low self-esteem, anxiety and depression, difficulty trusting others, feeling confused and disoriented, losing touch with reality. Meet Sarah. She used to have a happy and confident personality, but now she seems lost and unsure of herself. What happened to her? Sarah's partner. You're overreacting, Sarah. That never happened. Sarah. But I remember it clearly. You said those hurtful things to me. Sarah's partner responds. No, I didn't. You must be remembering it wrong. You have a bad memory. Sarah looks confused and unsure of herself. She is a victim of gaslighting, a manipulative tactic used by narcissists to control and dominate their victims. Sarah's partner replies, You're always so sensitive, Sarah. Can't you take a joke? It is a common gaslighting tactic to dismiss the victim's feelings and make them doubt their own emotions. Spotting gaslighting. You can break free from the chains of gaslighting and reclaim your reality. Here are some signs that you may be being gaslighted. You feel like you're losing your mind. You're constantly second-guessing yourself. You feel like you can't rely on your own memories. You're afraid to talk about your concerns with the person gaslighting you. Remember, you are not alone. Seek support from reliable and trusted friends or professionals who understand narcissistic personality. Breaking free from gaslighting. Gaslighting can have a severe impact on a person's mental health. Victims often develop anxiety, depression, and low self-esteem as a result of being constantly invalidated and made to feel crazy. Her gaslighting partner has shattered Sarah's confidence and sense of self, but there is hope. The first step to breaking free from the abuse for Sarah is to recognize gaslighting and to also understand that she is not the problem. She needs to trust her own perceptions and seek support from trusted friends and family. Here is Sarah standing up for herself in a confrontation with her narcissistic partner. She says, No, I won't let you gaslight me anymore. I know my truth and I won't let you manipulate and control me. By standing up to her abuser and setting boundaries, Sarah is on the path to healing and reclaiming her sense of self. If you think you're being gaslit, it's important to trust your gut. If something feels wrong, it probably is. Keep a record of the narcissist's gaslighting behavior. Jot down specific experiences with dates and times. Talk to a trusted friend, family member, or therapist for support. Set boundaries with the gaslighter and limit your exposure to them. Remember, you are not crazy. Gaslighting is a manipulative tactic designed to control and hurt you. By recognizing and breaking free from it, you can regain your confidence and reclaim your sense of reality. Don't let a narcissist make you doubt your own reality or diminish your truth. 
Stay strong, stay vigilant, and trust in your own perception. You deserve to live in a reality that is true to you. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like and subscribe to our channel for more content like this. Share your story and help others break free. Remember, you are not alone. Together, we can shine a light on gaslighting and protect ourselves and others from its harmful effects.